Hey, what's up guys? Marcus Ochoa here. And today in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a call to action button to your Facebook post, a, a learn more button, shop now button, a download button, sign up button. And I think there's one other option. But if you look, if right now we're looking at my page and you can see I have a learn more button. And when somebody clicks that, it takes them to my uh, my page my, my website so i'm going to show you how to add this button to your post and it's pretty simple to do first you you need to know that you can only do this through a fan page you can you cannot do it through a personal facebook page it has to be done through a fan page and i'm pretty certain that you also had to of uh, ran a facebook advertisement of some kind um, in the past which is which again is something that that's pretty simple to do so um, I'm just going to show you how to how to add that and we're going to to get there I'm going to go back to the Facebook home page I'm going to go to my ads manager and again you, you may not see the same things that I'm seeing if you've never ran an advertisement before you may need to find the ads manager uh, you know, somewhere else. Usually, it's at the very, very bottom of the page. You can find an ad advertising link somewhere, but um, you'll see mine is right here. It says Ad Manager. I'm going to click that, and it's going to take me to the ad Ads Manager. From here, I'm I want to go into my Power Editor. So I'm going to click on the Power Editor, and once you're in the Power Editor, if you've never used the Power Editor before. You are going to need to click this download to power editor button uh, select your account and click download and it only takes it only takes you know 10 10 or 15 seconds at the most and that's going to upload download all your information but uh, here on the left hand side it lists all your pages and you want to you want to select the page that you want to post to and right now I'm just going to select my main fan page, my, just my name, Marcus Ochoa, and I'm going to click click on Create Post. And it's real simple. It's real. It's real um, self-explanatory. All you're going to do is enter in, in the information. You're going to enter in the URL that you want to link to. So I'm going to copy and paste that URL here. And for the post text, I'm go I'm going to type in learn how to add a learn more button to your Facebook posts and here the call to action I select the button I, I want to use learn more now again if you're linking out to a page where you're selling something you can select shop now if you're giving away an ebook or something that people can download. You can you can choose download, or, or if your visitors are signing up for something, you can you can make the button say sign up. But I'm gonna make the button say learn more, and I'm going to leave this link headline blank. I'm gonna leave the display link blank and the description blank. And again, these are things that it pulls from your your web page, whatever you're linking to. So um, it 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 prefills that out for you. So I'm just gonna leave mine blank. And I'm going to for the picture. It also will import a picture from your web page if you have images on there. I'm going to upload an image just because it looks better that way. So I upload an image, and I'm going to select this post will only be used as an ad. Uh, for right now, I'm just showing this, showing you guys how to to to, to set this up. So I'm going to click create post. And it says it's creating post. Now, if I click over here on the post that I just uh, I just made, it I can view the post and what it looks like, and what it what it looks like uh, right here. So you can see it just has uh, has what I typed in here. It has my image, and it links out. and And there is the learn more button. So. In order to publish it, what you would do is you would click on this. You'd click on the post, highlight, so this bar highlights. Then you would click Publish Post. 
and you could you would click uh, publish. I'm not I'm not going to do it now because I I don't uh, I don't want it published. I actually already published this post, but I'm doing this to show you guys how to do it. So you would click publish, and you could do it now again, or you can schedule a time to do it later. And after you after you click publish, one more step that you want to make sure that you don't forget to do is click the upload change changes button. Once you click, once you click uh, publish post, this this upload changes button will turn green, and you have to click this before your your post is published. A lot of people will make the mistake of clicking publish post, and they forget to click the upload changes button. You have to click this, or else the post will not publish. But once you do click that, your post is is published. So that's how you do it. It's it's real simple and real uh, real easy to do. Again, if I show you what what my page looks like looks like i could show you the post i just made it says want to learn how to add a learn more button to your facebook post and it has uh, my image and the learn more button and i click it it takes people to my website so it's a great way to uh, get people to, to click your post it creates uh, more interaction more pe since people see that learn more button they're more likely to click it so uh, i hope you found that helpful if you have any questions uh, feel free to ask i'd be happy to happy to help you get them answered and uh, thanks for watching and have a great day